Now, prior to making this video, I actually had one planned where I was going to talk about a lot more stuff, a lot more in depth. But recently, another rumor has started circulating around about Thorpe Park's next investment. I would say next coaster, but at this rate, they're probably just going to build Black Mirror Labyrinth 2. So for the first time in a while, welcome to speculation time. time, time. Now, if you can't tell by my voice again, I am a bit ill. But like last time, the need to make this video is too urgent that I can't wait till I'm not ill. So as I said, there is a brand new rumour and also a brand new discovery in a certain area of the park. But I'll get onto that in just a minute. First, I want to quickly talk about something that will help back up this rumour more. So we all love our Fright Night scare mazes. Uh, obviously, you've got one such as the Big Top. I don't know, has anyone ever said they wanted to come back? The likes of Saw Alive, which, I'm going to say it, it's still sinking. And the main one I'm talking about is one that's been in the park as long as Darren Brown's Ghost Train has. Well, Platform 15. This maze has been part of the park's Fright Night's lineup since 2016. Jesus Christ. And as a lot of you know, it takes this route, starting in Old Town and ending back in Old Town but going all the way around where Logger's Leap went, which is their old log flume ride, and going underneath Saw as well. It's had its fair share of changes over time. They kicked the train over, and they turned half of what the maze was into a queue line. And as many of you guys know, it's now reached its final year. It's been officially announced by the park that it will not be open after this year, and it's literally the end of the line. That announcement is all over the emails they've been sending out, all of the promo for Platform 15, and also on some of the posters where it says end of the line and over it area under development which alongside that it's been noticed that there's been some land clearance round where platform 15 is some trees have been taken down you're gonna have people who will say that those trees will then be turned into a wooden coaster that it's gonna happen but no it is strange to see that they have done some clearance work along with the fact it's also been noticed that Logger's Leap is now potentially being taken down fully. The first people to really spot this was Theme Park Guide. Here are some photos on screen. Um, you have a very keen eye to be able to notice that. The fact the conveyor belt of the lift hill is now taken partially off. I don't think a man's going to climb up there, take part of the conveyor belt off for no reason and call it a date. You never know. The fact Platform 15 is not coming back, the fact it's also had land clearance around it, and Logger's Leap is being taken down, says a lot about what could be happening in that area. And the main rumour I was talking about earlier, Rocky Express is gone. I am a gone. Whoop. Is possibly being removed as well. Now, I know you may be thinking, oh, Rocky Express is a kid's ride. Why does that matter? And in all fairness, no one cares about Timber Tug or Lumber Jump. It's actually kind of sad. But if these rides and this ride are getting removed alongside platform and loggers, they're uh, bro, there's so much space there. Like, it definitely shows something is happening in Old Town, whether it be a massive refurbishment or a complete renovation or an RMC. And the reason I'm calling it a rumor and not a fact is because the way we know is staff have just been telling everyone who goes that it's going to be your last ride on Rocky Express ever, which it basically suggests it's going to close this year. Imagine it just opens next year. That would be quite funny. But all of this may mean nothing. Platform 15 might return as Platform 16. You may see Logger's Leap come back as a brand new shoot the shoot tidal wave and Rocky Express is just going to move two foot in the left direction. But it is interesting because you think of it, if they remove all those kiddie rides, get rid of Platform 15, clear that entire area, they have got such a nice plaza space to then go on to make a new coaster we can only hope for and it is kind of nice to go into the close season with a lot of speculation because it gets us very excited for what next year could have in store let me know what you guys think will go in that area or you want to go in that area personally they should just clone saw the ride and do it dueling okay right. <laughs>